Hello and welcome in the last video of this series about the NavMesh agents in Unity. Here we are going to see how we can use the obstacles or NavMesh obstacles component to create obstacles on our terrain. Let's go to the Polaris starter prefabs and choose a tree here. Let's place it here. And we can see that this is a pretty big tree. And we are going to use uh, control shift uh, being in the center mode and we're going to place it somewhere here okay we can maybe move it a little bit use again a control shift to place it somewhere around here okay we have our big tree we can hide it a little bit inside the terrain and how can we make it uh, impossible to pass through well we can simply go to nav mesh and add nav mesh obstacle into it and we can uh, open up the nav mesh obstacle and so we have our collider that you can as you can see this is pretty big so we can change the size of the collider using those uh, variables uh, we do not want to change it on x uh, on y we want to change it on x and on z okay something like this should work and when we select the curve option uh, we should be able to uh, see the navigation and it automatically has generated a, a carved hole where this uh, our tree is so we now have an impossible uh, space here uh, we could also create a, let's say a 3d object cube let's create a cube somewhere around here maybe let's drag it here in the in the spot and we are going to add to this cube a uh, also the navmesh obstacle and a rigid body to make it fall onto the ground and we are going to increase the i think z-axis yep great and now let's choose the navigation and let's press play we can see that there is no hole here but if we click behind this we can see that our avatar is going and he cannot really pass through this obstacle there is no way for him to do it but if we stop here and make our cube as the nav mesh obstacle and choose carve option we can press play and now if we go to our navigation there should be a seam here a, a hole so if we click here now our agent will choose a different route because there is no possible route here because our obstacle blocks the way so this is th those are a few ways that you can use nav mesh obstacles to adjust for your uh, buildings you could add those to those trees to make those trees impassable for our nav mesh agents and basically this is the idea behind nav mesh obstacles i hope you have enjoyed this video and this video series if you did please consider subscribing to the channel uh, sharing these videos and if you feel like it please consider supporting me through patreon the link is in the description so I can make more of those video series. So thank you for watching, take care.